Shootings have triggered a new awareness to violence, and now a new tool can help you track it all. 41 Action News reporter Brian Abel is here in the studio with local law enforcement and what it is saying about it all. Brian. Well, Mike Slate and The Trace put together an interactive map based on data by a DC nonprofit. You just plug in an address, and it shows you how many shootings have happened in a nearby radius over the past. Take a look here. You have it right at the plaza where we are. We also have Fairway, Kansas, two shootings within a two mile radius there. And if you take a look on East Kansas City at this address, 23 shootings within one mile, six fatal, 17 non fatal. And it could help you make a decision on where to buy a home or see how violent your neighborhood is. But some police say you should take the info with a grain of salt. Fairway Police Chief Mike Fleming says the map could be a good tool, but it comes from a source that may not give a complete picture. The data is from a nonprofit organization called Gun Violence. Archive. As an example, Fleming says a pair of Overland Park shootings at the same address last summer show up as only one on the map. He suggests calling the local police instead. I think if you were to call the locals, you will get complete information. Uh, you will get a more comprehensive picture of what's out there. Um, you will be able to talk to uh, actual officers who are in those neighborhoods, who are reading those reports. Um, the ones who are actually driving down those streets and handling those calls. And the people behind the data say their mission is to provide free online public access to accurate information about gun related violence in the United States and to add clarity to the ongoing discussion on gun violence, gun rights, and gun regulations. Live in studio, Brian Abel, 41 Action News.